Hey guys, good morning. Today I want to talk to you about breathing. And most of you guys, um, if you're anything like most Americans, you shallow breathe. And so uh, this means you're basically taking in little bits of oxygen at a time instead of taking deep breaths, which, which is actually going to bring oxygen to your brain, help you secrete uh, all sorts of great chemicals that are going to make you feel good. So one of the main reasons we feel great when we take a deep breath is because we secrete these chemicals when we do that, when we're breathing from the diaphragm. And so uh, same thing goes for working out. Um, I see a lot of you guys holding your breath when you're actually doing exercises and you're, uh, you're basically tiring out before you should because you're holding your breath. Now, I understand when you're pushing, the idea is that you know, you're just you're just pressing so hard you forget to breathe. But one of the things that I want to talk to you about being efficient and maximizing your workout is breathing, especially in between sets. You want to make sure that you're taking deep breaths. Uh, you want to make sure you raise your arms so that you open up your diaphragm and oxygen is coming into your body. And something that simple, um, I decided to talk uh, about just because uh, you guys forget you, you forget to breathe, and I see it all the time. I see how you start getting hypoxic, which is basically lack of oxygen to the brain as you're exercising uh, because you're so tense, you're thinking about what you have to do next, you're picking up weights, um, you're going hard, you're exhausted, and you forget to take these deep breaths. So part of being efficient, part of being uh, staying uh, um, the most efficient with your workouts is breathing. So how do we breathe? Really easy. We're inhaling through the nose, exhaling through the mouth, and you're actually uh, exhaling on the hard part of the exercise, okay? So say you're doing a chest press, you're coming in, you're taking a deep breath. As you push out, you're exhaling and getting rid of that oxygen. And that's gonna maximize your workout, that's gonna help you be more efficient, you're gonna recover better, um, your, your muscle tone is actually gonna look uh, a lot different if you're actually a, a, a deep breather versus a shallow breather. So I hope this helps. Very basic stuff, but super, super important and something that I often see that you guys forget to do. And so remember that um, <clears throat> your, your, the how you breathe is going to control your emotional state as well. Right. This is the reason why uh, when we have stressful moments, we take deep breaths. Our bodies automatically know to do that. And so I encourage you guys to breathe better, especially when you're working out in between those rest periods since we do hit cardio here you have 15 seconds to transition from one uh, station to the next take deep breaths raise your arms open your diaphragm and you're going to feel a lot better i hope this helps this is jt tapius ending today with the series on uh, maximizing your workouts i hope you got something out of this i hope to hear more from you guys and next week we're going to be talking about some amazing amazing topics i'm going to keep you guessing so i'm not going to tell you but uh, wait for that email, wait for that uh, video on Monday. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.